God, her heart rate's increasing. Felicia, honey, fight. Oh, please. Check a pulse. Keep fighting, her please. blood pressure's rising. Please. Heart rate is 60 in climbing. She's stabilizing. <laughs> what did I tell you, Dominic? She just needed you. She just needed her baby boy. Oh, good morning. I wasn't expecting you this early. Oh, well, I couldn't wait to pick up Dominic. Where is he? Uh, sleeping. Still? That kid usually gets up with the sun. My fault. I kept him up past his bedtime. Oh, well. Did you have a good time? Wonderful. Good. I was beginning to worry about you a little bit. Oh, I'm fine. But thank you. <sighs> Kid's pretty amazing, isn't he? Yes, he truly is. That smile, ugh. It's just like a dose of sunshine. Yeah, he has Felicia's smile. By the way, I wanted to tell you, I really did understand what you meant last night about needing hope. It was like that for me. And taking care of Dominic helped me cope with the loss of Nicole when nothing else could. He's become very important to you, hasn't he? the most important thing in my life. But Stephanie, that, that, you know, I know that you need to spend time with your grandson too, so anytime you need him, please, just let us know. I will. Good. So, having him here last night really helped, huh? It was just what the doctor ordered. Oh, there's my sweet angel. <gasps> Is he still asleep? Yeah. Oh, baby. Oh, Mommy missed you so much. Yes, I did. I missed you so much. Mommy? Oh, well, Mommy, Bridget. Though the older he gets, I'm sure he'll drop the Bridget. <laughs> You're really committed to raising him with Dante, aren't you? One hundred percent. Well, I'm sure Dante's very grateful for that. I know it's only been a few days, but... We're already starting to feel like a family. You, you are his family. I mean, even if you didn't raise the baby, you're still his aunt. Well, I'm so much more than that, though, now. Yeah, but you and Dante aren't committed to some sort of a relationship. Well, <laughs> we're both completely committed to Dominic. Well, yeah, I guess what I meant was... No, I, uh... I, I actually, I know what you mean. I was concerned about it before, too. Before I was made the legal guardian of him. What do you mean, legal guardian? Well, before Felicia died, she had papers drawn up that made me the legal guardian. She didn't say anything to me about that. And me either. It doesn't really surprise me, though. You know how determined she was to make all the right arrangements for her son. It makes me feel so good that she trusted me that much. Well, I, I, I'm sure you'd do a wonderful job, but my gosh, Bridget, you can't give up your own career. What's all this about career? Oh, hello, Eric. Uh, I was uh, just saying to Bridget she can't give up on her career. Are you considering doing that? No, I'm not. Though I have talked to my supervisor about cutting back on a few hours. Well, even if you did that, you'd still be really busy. I know, it's not going to be easy. But, you know, working, raising a child. But my priority is still Dominic. Yes, you see, but that's what I'm concerned about. You're becoming so attached to him. So attached? Stephanie, why would you say something like that? Felicia wanted Dominic to be with me. I'm his mother now. 